welcome back. Apologize about the hammering. You're going to hear it in the background. My son is out on the porch putting up our, our squirrel feeder that we have. We have two huge 10-pound bags of different types of squirrel feeding uh, feed for them so that they can come up and enjoy some food here on our porch because we have a family of 10 squirrels. We have a mommy, a daddy, and eight baby and teenage squirrels running around our yard. And we're just going to go ahead and make sure that they get some food. I'm going to make sure some water's put out. It's 102 degrees today, y'all. It is hot, 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 hot outside. With that being said, here is my Amazon Prime Day haul. I don't know if I bought on Amazon Prime Day 1 or Amazon Prime Day number 2. But these are the containers that I purchased. I will be unboxing these and showing you the full sets. I will link each set down below in the description box down below. Now, do know that I am not an affiliate with Amazon, but I would like to give you guys the information in case you're interested. I did get an 18-piece set from Amazon. I got two 12-piece sets and two 6-piece sets. What I plan to do is I'm going to use these glass containers, which are microwave safe, convention, convection oven safe, the regular conventional oven safe. They are dishwasher safe. They are refrigerator safe. And I think I did say freezer safe. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to start meal prep, prepping and portioning things out so that my kids can just go in, grab a chili the night before that's already pre-made, that was homemade, put into a container. They can leave it in the refrigerator overnight, and then the next day they can heat it up and things of that nature. I might make some casseroles and things of that nature as well. I will unbox these sets for you so that you can see. This cost me $109, y'all. But... I had to buy these things. It's for many different reasons. Number one, I don't like plastic containers. And you know, blind people should not be around glass containers. I'll be real honest. There's many, many times I've knocked mason jars off the counter or glass containers off the counter and broke them. But with that being said, we're going to be super, super, super careful with what I'm doing. But plastic containers keep their smells. I don't feel like I'm getting them clean enough. Even if I use bleach water, I don't feel like I'm getting them clean enough. And with that being said, these glass containers is what I really wanted. Um, these smaller meal containers like this will be for Jessica and myself. Um, she'll have six, I'll have six. And then I know some of these other boxes have a mixture of different sizes that may also carry some more extra ones of the little ones. But I can do all kinds of different meal preps. I can put them in the freezer ahead of time and then thaw them out the night before that we actually put things either in the oven or the refrigerator or the convection oven or the microwave or things of that nature. Again, I do not recommend that you actually go from freezer straight to an oven or anything like that because, you know, you don't want to risk anything of being shattered or anything like that. And I don't think these have an issue with that, but it's always in the care instruction. And it's always safe to just make sure you thaw your items out ahead of time. But if you make the meals, then guess what? That's all you got to do is saw it out the night before, throw it in your fridge, and then cook it the next day, whether it be the convection oven, the conventional oven, the microwave, or whatever. They're also, as I said, dishwasher safe. They are just great containers to have overall. So I'm going to go ahead and unbox these and show you what I got. Again, I said I paid $109 between all of these sets. I got one set of 18 mix set two sets of 12 and i think the 12 had one cup and two cup serving sizes i believe um don't quote me on that because i will throw all that down in the description box down below and then two of the smaller um i believe these are the one cup sizes is what they are i think they're the eight ounce cups um sizes and that and this is just going to be a game changer for our family so let me go ahead and unbox this and show you the whole setup that we have um with our hawking anchor hawking <laughs> Uh, containers so just like the Pyrex ones y'all so let me unbox this and show you what we got all right everyone we've unboxed everything we are back and I am happy 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 to show you all the different sizes we got we did end up with a ton of the smallest ones possible which is really what I was leaning a lot towards that will be a lot more towards Jessica um, I do believe that they're like the one size cup which is like eight ounces which is great um, that will go for some of her meals and things of that nature. I absolutely, absolutely love it. We also have some of the two ounce size cups too as well. Great things to have for um, if somebody wants like a chili or something like that. Instead of having like a 16 ounce can of chili at the store, I do make my chili homemade. The kids prefer it that way anyways. So we've got a ton of those in stock as well. We have a little bit more of a bigger version here as well. And the variety is absolutely just wonderful. So I just put some in front of the other ones. I didn't want to stack it up too high and end up um, 
having an issue and having things slide and break, I, I probably would cry if that happened. So we got a great variety. We also have two of the really, really big ones. These usually will be probably for either like family meals that I can make, um, either for the kids or vegetarian meals for myself or vegetarian meals for myself and the kids. And these are the two really, really big ones. Um, also, I will guarantee you one of these is actually gonna be for my salads as well. And Jessie does like salads too. She won't eat the salad like we eat salad here at the house. She will have to have hers in like a salad kit and things of that nature that she can break it down over two different salads. But with all that being said, I just wanted to come on and show you that we did have this completely unboxed. I'm very happy with the sizing of everything. I'm happy with the quality of everything. Do know that the lids are like the silicone type lids in a sense. So these cannot be put into microwaves. They cannot be put into any type of an oven or anything of that nature. I do believe that they can be put in a dishwasher, but I'm not sure. I don't own a dishwasher. I'm going to go ahead and hand wash all of this, hand dry all this, and get ready to meal prep this coming week on Thursday, coming up on the 3rd of August. So, questions, comments, concerns, suggestions, throw them at me in the comment section down below. I will link all three of these sets for anybody's um, pleasure if they would like to actually go and check them out. Again, I got two of the six-piece sets. I got two of the 12 piece sets and I got one of the 18 piece sets. Now remember, um, sometimes they will actually uh, make sure that the lids are at the very bottom of some of the boxes. So make sure you remove all the cardboard at the bottom because that's where we found some of the lids. I thought that we're missing some lids, but once my son removed the bottom piece of the cardboard inside the box, there were some extra lids down there that actually came with our container. So we didn't have anything missing. So that's what we have for you today. Again, this was on Amazon Prime Day, $109. And I'm very, very happy with this. All of my Tupperware is now going to be trash. That is actually plastic and we are gonna stick with glass containers. The only thing else that I need to get is some four ounce containers, which I'll be looking at like the baby food four ounce jar containers that you can reuse over and over again as well. And uh, I'll have those in the freezer for things like frozen fruit portion sec sections and things of that nature. So anyways, that's what we have for you today. Have a great blessed weekend. We'll catch you on Monday. Until then, Without Limits is out.